Uh, with the man of the hour, it's CT motherfucking Fletcher. We, we say that a lot, but this and, and Vlad, who made the film, um, but this is this is different. This is a different side of you. We're getting we get to see the whole, the real CT. What's what's up with that? Are you excited? I'm, I'm very excited, um, and uh, I didn't think this day would ever come. People get to see that I can say more than fuck. Yeah, although I do You're enjoy really saying that. fuck, I, but I do have a you know I can't have a, big, a wider vocabulary than just that. Right, and you have a, a backstory and and all this. So what does it mean? What did it mean to you to to get this story told? And and then next, I'm gonna ask Vlad. Why, why CT? Why did you want to make it? That's well, it, it means everything to me. Uh, the, the movie is dedicated to my mom, uh, a lady who was selfless in every way possible. She never would uh, tell her own story. So I asked God to uh, make a way that I could get it out there. So I'll tell, I'll tell it for you, Mom. She's in heaven, yeah. so hopefully she's happy tonight. I mean, she already knows what the movie's like. We get to see it for the first time. You know the movie, the entire movie. What um, what made you want to do a movie about Anthony The man right here. That really explains everything. You know, uh, he captures the the screen, and he carries the whole film on his own. And in Generation Nine, people know there was many many characters. You know, but he does it on his own, and it's incredible. His story is just so inspirational to me that I became one of the biggest CT fans after making that film. So did he ask you to do the film or did you ask him to do the film? I heard that there was some back and forth with other people was, wanting to do I think a it was film. I think it was mutual. I think it was both. I wanted to make a film about him and he wanted me to direct it. So yes, I, it, just I kinda, want, it was organic. Yeah. I definitely wanted to make the movie. I tried to make it uh, on my own. Didn't have the resources to do it. I tried and failed. I needed help and I seen Generation Iron and from the success of Generation Iron and the way it was done, Vlad was the man. And you have your whole family here. That's pretty awesome. And we're at Olympia Weekend, which is a huge freaking weekend for bodybuilding, for muscle heads, for iron addicts. Yes, definitely. Uh, my whole family's here, grandkids, and second cousins, third cousins, twice removed. <laughs> Everybody who ever knew me since I was two years old is They're here proud. in the building. <laughs> yes, absolutely. Well, what are you looking forward to this weekend besides your movie? Uh, besides the movie, we're opening another Iron Addicts here, right here in Las Vegas. I'm looking forward to shaking all the Iron Addicts' hands tomorrow and the next day, uh, Friday and Saturday at the Olympia. Uh, I'm just glad to be here, man. I'm happy I'm alive to see this day. Absolutely. You are alive and well, looking great, and you owe me a push-up contest. Not in this suit, though. I'm not going to ask you to mess Not it in up. this suit. I, I, I don't want to embarrass They're myself. They're waiting on Twitter. They're waiting. Okay. <laughs> it's coming. It's coming, but not today. Thank you so much, and thank you for making the film. Signing out, Generation Iron.